Hi. Oh, hey. Hey, everybody. This is the debut of Two Dudes Who Love Sports, the new podcast out for all your sports needs. Get your fix we with us. We love sports. We love sports. <laughs> we love talking about sports. We love playing sports. We're two good sports here. We're not. Poor. And what's your name? What's your name, I'm sir? I'm Damien. Damien Cole from San Francisco, California. Former, former. Where's my shirt? Former security guard for the San Francisco Giants. Yes. I worked on the field in the clubhouse at the gates, so I know a lot of backstories from the Giants over the years. And what's your name? My name is Wesley Garrity from San Francisco. I'm 41. And my favorite teams are Warriors, mm-hmm. San Francisco Giants, and the Niners. Uh-huh. Maybe that's that's what it's about, you know. What's your Niners gear? You got some socks or something? Um, I might since I live in Vietnam now. I don't have all my clothes from home, <laughs> so I might wear my same Frank Gore jersey every day because mm-hmm. that's well, the only Niners gear I have. <laughs> we'll wear that on Mondays because in but Vietnam. You got your, um, uh-huh. The game, the game, the Sunday games come on like Monday morning at like 3 a.m. Right, right. Oh, uh, we'll do like a Monday, but it, it'll be a Sunday back in America. And for everyone listening, how long have I known you for, Damien? Jesus Christ. Fucking too long. I know it. I wrote it down. <laughs> 20. I'm old enough. 27 years or something? 27 years, exactly. Fucking nuts. That's a long time, guys. So. We know our shit, okay? We know our sports. Uh, yeah, yeah we, we like other things, too. <laughs> but we both live in Vietnam. It's not no bromance thing. Uh, we have families. <laughs> so um, let's get into the Giants. Um, yes. We played the Cubs last night. I stayed up to 1.20 a.m. to watch this game. Mm-hmm. And we are fighting the Dodgers right now for first place and we're two and a half games in first and we played the Cubs and Chris Bryant came back his first game back in Wrigley Field since we acquired him mm-hmm. and we won six to one yeah um do you see any of the game Damien I did yeah. I saw I watched the highlights I saw uh I saw Longoria go yard into the into the deep. Welcome part. back, Longoria. <laughs> Welcome back. Evan, and, not even. Uh-huh. I think Belt went yard too. Belt, Belt went yard. I think he went opposite field, right? Yeah, he did. Opposite. Uh-huh. Yeah. And yeah. uh Wade Jr. got an RBI. Lamont yeah. Wade Jr., our new guy. Yeah. And um Someone else got an RBI. I can't remember. But, uh, someone had a pinch. D- Duggar. Duggar got an RBI. Pinch hit RBI. Dougie. And we won 6-1. Um, let me add something to uh, when Chris Chris Bryant's first at bat. I was watching this game on the Cubs stream because I'm in Vietnam. Mm-hmm. So I was listening to the Cubs announcers. His first at bat, um, all the cheers, all the Cubs fans were cheering for him, like standing up. And uh, when he went to the when he went to home, when he went to the plate, the bat, they had the song from Criss Cross, 90s rap group, Warm It Up, Chris. I'm about to. Wow. And the fans, classy Cubs fans, they, they stood, they yep. were standing the whole time at, it, at his at bat. Yeah. So that was kind of cool to see. But you remember that song from Criss Cross, right? How could, of course. How could I ever and forget that song? Chris Bryant spells his name with a K, like Criss Cross. So that must have been his thing so that was kind of a cool thing to see uh the cubs were like respecting him i so believe much. he got an mvp for yes. the cubs uh, i MVP. think he got a ring he's been there for a long i yeah. think they said he got a ring and an mvp but you know he's yeah. he's a huge pickup you yeah. know uh, but it was really cool to see um obviously we're a better team we have the best record in the league yeah and cubs are you know bad so hopefully, you know, we sweep them. Um, but, you know, Kapler, 91 wins already. Uh, I would say hands down coach of the year. It's not even a question. What do you yeah. Think? Yeah, he's doing all kinds of stuff. Did anyone like, see us 
winning this many games before the season? <laughs> no, I thought we were done. I thought the Giants were toast. I thought we were just going to let Posey and Belt and, and yeah. Crawford oh, just retire. Guys. But yeah. they're they're playing. The core is still our dynasty playing. core is still there. That's the core. Those three guys are the core. You know, what? no more. Right. We don't, we don't got Jackson. Mad Bum anymore. We don't got a Kane. We don't got Lincecum. But but right. the, those three guys right there, that's still the core. I don't believe anyone else is still on the team from What from do you our think heydays. the Vegas odds were for the Giants to win maybe 100 games and we'll probably get there this season? Damn, I like, wish I like bet. One in a, there's no way. I You'd wish be I rich bet. right now, dude. Because, like... Look at these, look at our, yeah, our, look at the names on this team. Like, I I can't even barely recognize any. I know them now, but. Yeah, Strimsky. Season, <laughs> yeah, he's Strimsky. Yep. You know, hailed his uh, grandfather. I think he was a great baseball player. Yeah. Um, we got all these guys. Um, But I was listening to the. Cubs announcers, and they were bringing up some crazy numbers. I have a little trivia for you, Damien. So we have power, but we don't have power. That sounds kind of funny. Um, So Mm -hmm. I'll show you why. Um, When do you think was the last time Giants had a 30 run or more home run hitter on our team? When and who? Just take a guess. This is a hard trivia. So I hope it's you, not. I hope it's not Barry Bonds in the '73 home run you season. You got it on the money. That this is the last time we oh, had a 30 run and plus home run hitter was Barry Bonds in 2004. Damn, that was the last t- t- time we had someone to hit 30 home runs or more. 2004. Damn. Damn, I would have well, thought that. Well, I get one point for the trivia right there. Yeah, no, you definitely. I, I had no clue you'd get that. I thought you would wow. say Posey or no, like Bell, no. you know. No. Um, I have one more. Okay. This is another kind of weird one. Uh, who has the, – these are the – coming from the Cubs announcers. I was loving them watching this because they were talking about how they were talking to John Miller before the game and getting all this info from mm-hmm. John Miller, great uh, mm-hmm. announcer. The GOAT. Um, who has the most home runs by a giant at AT&T Park, Giant Stadium, at home um, since 2010? So let me make it easier to, uh, for you to respond. Which giant has the most home runs and how many home runs uh, were there from that giant since 2010? So who has the most home runs at Giant Stadium from a giant since 2010? How many home runs do you think it was? 2010. Let me see. Shoot. I don't think it's Brandon Belt. Uh, I, well, how many? Let's work with how many do you think was the most home runs by a hometown giant since 2010? In the in one season or the whole in time? one season? In, in one, one season. season, Jesus. In one season. It's got to be like. 25 maybe at the most <laughs> 20, uh-uh. I'll, not I'll even tell you less 11 okay okay at at, at, at home in the at ballpark home. okay at okay. home in our ballpark since our ballpark is the worst for we hitting home runs one player had the most had 11 home runs that was the most home runs at our home park by yeah. our own player in one season since 2010. And guess who it is? You'll never fuck, you'll never fucking guess. <laughs> he played yesterday. I'll give you a hint. He, he played, played yesterday. yesterday. Yes, and he had the most home runs. And it, it could be anyone, it could be Belt, it could be, but um one giant, he had the most home runs since 2010 Brandon at home Crawford. Is no. It Crawford? No. <laughs> I'll tell you, it's a okay, Lamont tell. Wade Jr. No way. Guy. He hit the most home runs ever by a giant this, at our home since 2010. This year? This, this year? year? That this is year. nuts, dude. Wow. It's the new guy. Uh, what wow. a great pickup. He we was, have. Right? No, we Insane. That's <laughs> crazy. It's crazy. Our power. That's in, we don't I mean, have we power. A bunch That's of guys why. that have pop. 
That's why it's nuts that we're hitting some. We're hitting so many home runs, but they're mostly on oh, the road. Right. It's all yeah. on the road. If we if number? if we I'm had a ballpark, because it's always windy and 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 so cold there and windy and and, and it's huge and it's huge and you got to get over the right field. Yeah, the That's right field is like forty feet high, thirty seven feet yeah, high. Like, something I forget. But crazy. yeah, it's ridiculous. Like if Barry Bonds played in St. Louis, he would have like 800 home runs. It's like more than that, probably. Yeah, yeah, no doubt. If he played in Yankees and the original oh, Yankee God. Stadium during that time. Yeah. No, Colorado. Oh God, he'd have a thousand. A thousand easy. Literally. Yeah. Easy. Easy. Yeah. So, so um so how then, many uh, I got one for you then. All right. So how many players? Okay, the Minnesota Twins. No, wait. Toronto Blue Jays have the the record for most home runs by a team in one season, three hundred and seven. Okay. Uh huh. The wow. nine, 2019 wow. Twins. Yeah. Uh, the Giants are not on pace, but we're not gonna, we're not going to break that record. But the Twins had eight players that hit 20 home runs okay right eight different players so the giants we have three players over 20 right now three players with 17 so what do you think right. you think we're gonna break that record you think we could get eight player we got flores has 17 well belt 22 your 22 crawford 20 oh flores God. 17 buster 17 wade jr 17 uh hmm. Rough. I mean, we got 15. a lot of guys with pop. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I we mean got... these aren't outstanding numbers, but they're good uh, for a whole team. Yeah. Like everyone can hit the shit out the ball. It yeah. Seems like. yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe. Because <laughs> they say um, that's our strength. No. <laughs> huh? They say that's our strength this year, our home run hitting. Oh, and our um our fucking defense, bro. Yeah, yeah. Did you see Crawford's play yes. last night? Unbelievable. This morning? <laughs> Double play. One behind hand. the back flip to the to the second baseman. Caught it with one hand and threw it to first. Yeah, it was delicious. That was lovely. So what do you think? After that, the Cubs announcer said MVP MV, uh, Crawford's going to get MVP votes this year as an MVP as a whole. The Cubs wow. announcer said that. Wow. Bold wow. Glover, too, they said. Wow. Let's get it. Let's get what it. What were you going to say? What do you think – how far are the Giants going to go this year? Are we going to win it? Because we've won – like, this is actually a pretty talented team. We won – we won I'm with gonna, less talent. Okay, and then some other – The Cody numbers. Ross years? Come on. Yeah. Our pitching, <laughs> the Cubs announcers were saying how we have the best bullpen in the league. Yeah. We have the best ERA yeah. bullpen in the league. We have one of the best starting pitching ERA in the league. So, I'm going to say – Yes, I'm going to say Chris Bryant, Longoy are going to kill it. Yep. I'm going to say our core from the dynasty, Belt, Crawford, and Posey are going to give all our young guys energy or pitching and bring that championship energy like, you know, like Curry and Clay Thompson, I think, and Draymond are going to do with the Warriors this year. Similar to that. I think they're going to have similar seasons. I believe it, too. We got the pitching, and in our – we platoon our players so well, like – if it's a right-hand pitcher, Brandon Belt's yeah. going to play. If it's a left-hand pitcher, uh, we got Ruff at first base. Uh, I've seen right. like four different players play first base. Um, the outfield is all interchangeable. The Shrimpsky could play left or right, you know. Yeah, center. He was playing center, center. yesterday. Yeah, yeah he could play all three. <laughs> so we're deep as hell. We're we could platoon any player at any position almost. Speaking about platooning, guess how many pitchers we had pitched yesterday? Take a guess. Mm. One guess. Four. Eight. Eight pitchers. Leon started, pitched two innings. Yeah. And then we had seven pitchers after him. Yeah. That's he had nice. eight. I, I looked it up. But, uh, yeah. And we had that's a team. Pitchers. That's like no one – Go no one's them. mad. Like, no one's going to say, oh, I want the starting. I want to get my win. Like, we just want to win as a team. That's how Everybody's I feel. Everybody's contributing. Is. Kaplan, yep. easily yep. coach of the year, like, yep. hands down. It's not even close. Yep. You know, we, we're probably going to win 100. Um, so, so we're two and a half games mm -hmm. up um, against the Dodgers. 
Yeah. Um, they're playing the Padres now, a pretty good team. So hopefully they lose a couple and we win some. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep. So yeah, that's yeah. Good stuff, buddy. Win the West. Let's do it. And we'll see the Dodgers. We'll see the Dodgers in the playoffs because we don't see them again all year, right? We're done with them for the rest We're, of the year. We are done with them. Yes. Yeah, yeah. We are done. Yeah. Um, so we play the Cubs again. Um, 1.20 a.m. Vietnam time. I'm going to stay up for it again. Um, maybe watch the first five innings or something. Yeah. But um, yeah, it's pretty exciting. Um, you know, us being from San Francisco, we have Niners, Giants, Warriors. Uh, yeah. Pretty exciting stuff this year, I think. Yeah, that yeah. should be a good year for the Bay, man. Good year. Niners. And for anyone watching or listening, uh, we'll talk about all sports, but mostly our home teams. Yeah. But if you have any questions or yeah. anything, just uh, write a reply. Um, comment. But, comment. If you want us to talk about something, just put it in the comments. We'll do yeah, it. If you want to talk shit to us, go ahead. Yeah. I'm good at that, too. Yeah. <laughs> if you want to have an argument or discussion, if you think you know more about ba basketball is my favorite sport. If you think you know more about that than me. I'm 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 all for it. Um, I I think I'll I think I'll serve you. <laughs> yeah. Right. So um, yeah. Uh, so this is our first show. Um, anything else you want to say, Damien? No, nah, we'll uh we'll do another show on the Warriors soon, and uh, uh we'll do and the a, Niners. The we'll Niners do a show play. opening day, right? Opening day coming. Opening day soon. Niners. That will be Monday in Vietnam since we're ahead of the United States. Yeah. So we might be a little late on it. Yeah, we'll do one. We'll do one Monday well, night. Um, maybe if, you know, we can do a show after every, uh, there's a lot of Giants games, but maybe, maybe, maybe after every Warriors game, they're Niners game. Yeah, yeah, we'll figure it out. And, and we'll um, touch all different topics. We'll talk about Ben Simmons. Even movies. Trying to get on the Warriors. <laughs> yeah, we'll do that. Plus sports movies, anything. Yeah. Good idea. Warrior, definitely Good Warrior. Idea. Uh, basketball yeah. is my favorite sport, and uh, baseball and football is a tie for me. Yeah. I love them all pretty much the same, but um, I would say I'm most knowledgeable on basketball. But I know we know our shit on baseball, football, pretty pretty yeah. more than the average. I would say. Yeah, um, I would say but, too. Um, oh, are we gonna have um any graphics to uh? music for our opening in the future maybe. uh maybe in the future we'll see we'll see yeah. keeping it simple what's the first. name of the show two dudes who love sports or you can two just call who love sports Is that you can just call it two dudes <laughs> two dudes i i i said two dudes that love sports or two dudes that who loves sports <laughs> we'll figure it out uh yeah. this is our first one yeah um i thought that went pretty well. Uh, speaking on, you know, uh, good that we won the game last night. Um, it's better to speak sports when your team wins, you know? Hell yeah. It's always good. Yeah. You know. Yeah, cool. Um, anything else? Um, uh, you know, it was fun to watch the game last night for me. Um, you know, some of those whopping uh, trivia questions at the home runs. Yeah. You know, are pretty crazy that we haven't had a 30 plus home run hitter since Bonds 2004. Yeah. But um, our, let's talk a little about our young guys. Um, we have so many new players. Um, it's, it's hard to even remember. Like Yasminski, uh, Duger, uh, Lamont Wade Jr. has been all these young guys are contributing so, so huge. Yeah. You know, um, we have a bunch of other new guys, but, um, you know, our pitching's been amazing. Galsman pitches tonight. Galsman yep. pitches. I like Galsman. You know, um, if, um, yeah, if anyone wants to add anything, um, we're just doing a brief uh, post-game wrap-up, so we're not going with the super details, like yeah. we've got a double or single, mostly just RBIs. But we can get more into that. Um Maybe tomorrow we will. We're going we will. Basics and talk about cool things. Cool yeah. things we have. Especially on when the playoffs roll around, which is uh, next so, month. Playoffs next month. Uh, oh, Warriors next month. Uh, yeah, Warriors the Niners starting this weekend. 
the thing Ooh. about it is that. Ooh, here we go. We play um we play Detroit on uh let's yeah, let's change it a little bit of football. We play Detroit on Sunday, Sunday, Sunday football. I think the early game, I think the 10 a.m. game. It will be uh midnight here in Vietnam. The our yeah. Niners game will happen at midnight. So I might catch the beginning or maybe yeah. the probably the whole game to be because it's yeah. a midnight game here. Yeah. Against Detroit. Um it's not too late. But the Niners are stacked, man. Uh, I don't know how long you want to go on, but we can make a segment about Niners. Well, let's just do Boy, Giants. Geez. We'll do Giants right now. Let's yeah. do let's do another one for the Niners. For the we'll do future. another one. Yeah. For the future, we, we can speak night. Everybody out there, we can go Niners Warriors for probably five hours easily. Easy. No joke. Because that's what we be talking our on our uh, off time anyway, <laughs> pretty yep. much. Mm-hmm. Yep. Cool. Yep. All right. So let's sign off and uh we'll we'll hit you back after the Niners game. We'll see you guys after the Niners game. All right. Right on. Bro. Yeah, if you got any good, comments, uh, suggestions, show. say anything, uh-huh. anything you want to say, put it in the comments. We will respond. Call right? her, say what's up. Yeah. Whatever's clever. Yeah. <laughs> all right. It's a cool game. Um, I'll hit you up later. Two dudes that love sports. Um that's not officially our name yet, so it might. But if you have any requests yeah. for a name that about two dudes that know their sports, uh, just well, let's keep that. Comments. I like that one. I like yeah, that. two dudes that love sports. That's it. That's a yep. stamp. But keep it. If you don't like it, hate on it. Yeah. Come watch us, haters. It's all good. Yeah. Lovers, whoever. I don't <laughs> care. <laughs> any yeah. sports fan, come watch us and let's talk sports. And maybe we can do like a live show. With the audience sometime or something. We'll do it. Questions. We'll do it. Yeah. Cool, man. Like, subscribe, and um, comment, all that good stuff. Make sure you like and subscribe so we can uh, know who's out there, who's watching us, and leave us some comments, all right? All right, thanks for watching, y'all. Peace. Later. Deuces. Peace.